Draft and shell features are other common features that you'll apply to your models, particularly when designing plastic or molded parts. The icons are grouped together on the toolbar with other applied features, and we'll start by looking at the shell feature. The options for the shell are straightforward. Uh, type in a wall thickness, and in the Faces to Shell selection window, you can pick any faces that you would like to remove. When I click OK, the feature is added. Of course, anytime you're applying shell or draft features for that matter, the order in which you apply them is important since it has such a significant impact on the resulting geometry. In this case, I should have applied the shell command before all of these vents. Since Onshape is a history based system, the fix here is simple. I can just click and drag the feature in the feature list to move it up before the vents. Let's switch over to another example. In cases where you need to apply a slope to faces of your models, the draft feature is what you'll use. Before I launch the command, let me roll back in the feature list. The draft command has fields for neutral plane and entities to draft. The neutral plane is the plane or surface that will determine the direction of the draft angle. I'll select this face. And for the entities to draft, I'll select these outer faces. I'll type in a draft angle of 6 degrees. And you can always use the opposite direction button to change the draft from going outward or inward from the neutral plane. The preview slider can also be useful here to visualize the results. I'll click OK and the feature is added. At this point, I'll roll to the end of the features list to show you one more helpful option with the draft. I'll use the same face as the neutral plane, and again use 6 degrees. But before I select anything, notice the draft feature also includes an option for tangent propagation. Because of the fillets here, the tangent propagation option makes it incredibly easy to apply the draft to the remaining interior faces.